today I am going to be doing a back to school tutorial because I've been getting tons of requests from you guys to do back to school stuff. So I thought it would be good to start off with makeup and I am going to be showing you how to do the look that I'm wearing right now. So this look is under $20. All of the makeup and tools, everything that I used adds up to be under $20. And I decided to do this just because I thought it would be really fun. You guys seem to enjoy my last $20 makeup challenge video. So I thought this would be good to do for back to school. So this look that I'm wearing right now is fun and girly, but it's still comfortable to wear to school. And this is something that I feel like would also go with a lot of different styles, different outfits, different hairstyles. I feel like it just looks good with everything. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial and let's go ahead and get started. The first thing I'm going to be using is my Essence Cover Stick in the shade Matte Beige. So I'm going to be using this in the place of foundation to cover up hyperpigmentation, blemishes, any kind of discoloration on my face. And I'm also going to be using this underneath my eyes as well. So this is an all around great product. It gives really great coverage, but it doesn't feel as heavy as foundation. To set the concealer, I'm going to be using my NYC Loose Powder in the shade Naturally Beige. And this product works especially well for people with oily skin because it helps reduce shine and it also helps prevent makeup meltdown throughout the day. Then I'm going to use my Wet n Wild Brow Pencil in the shade Mink Brown and I'm going to use this to fill in my brows and add a little bit of definition. For eyes, I'm going to use my e.l.f. cream eyeshadow in the shade Candlelight, and I'm going to use this to add a little bit of brightness to my eye area. So I'm going to start off by applying it to the center of my lid and then working it out. And then I'm going to use this as a brow bone highlight as well as an inner corner highlight. Next, I'm going to be using this eyeliner duo from NYC, and I'm going to start off by using the pencil eyeliner to line the upper inner rim of my eyes. And this is going to help my eyelashes look fuller and thicker. Then I'm going to line my upper lash line with the liquid liner, and I'm going to wing it out a little bit by following the natural line of my lower lashes. Now it's time to curl my eyelashes with my e.l.f. eyelash curler. For mascara, I'm going to be using All Eyes on Me by Essence, and I'm just going to use this to coat my top lashes. You can go ahead and coat your bottom lashes if you'd like, but I'm just going to stick to my top lashes. For a natural rosy glow, I'm going to be using my e.l.f. blush in Tickled Pink, and I'm also going to be using my e.l.f. angled brush to apply it. On my lips, I'm going to be using my NYX lip gloss in beige, which actually isn't beige, it's a light mauve pink color, and this is one of my favorite lip glosses because it enhances your natural lip color and it tastes amazing. Okay, so this is the finished look and I hope you guys enjoyed my tutorial and be sure to check out my last beauty video which was my outfits of the week that I did while I was in London and Paris and that basically just shows you guys the outfits that I wore during a week and it also has clips of my trip so it's kind of like telling a story at the same time. So I will link that video down below and at the end of this video if you guys want to go and watch it. But I think that's going to be it for today. So I hope you all are doing really well and I will see you guys later. Bye!